Hello, Barry. Hello again, everybody. Um, today I'm going to show you a cool thing in Google Maps. If you have a, um, let's say, you want to go from, say, I'm somewhere in Boston. And let's say I want to go, let's say, Museum of African American History. <clears throat> And then hold directions. And then I'm gonna go to Final Hall. So it's gonna bring me that way. But if I want to adjust the route, like let me flip it. And maybe I want to go this way. That's what I which what you're gonna do. Is you can drag this and drag this down. Sometimes it works like that. And and sometimes not by the way it suggests it's actually just a trap, but by the way you do it, it'll reduce the traffic that travel time that you have. Sometimes it doesn't work out, but So, that can work here. So, it's very finicky on how you're supposed to be it, but when you do get it done, yeah, but it's supposed to not really changeable, but sometimes you're able to change it like this. Oh, that's why I took me that. So that's why I would have taken me that. But there's reasons why it does that. Maybe it gets. So that is how you actually do it by adjusting the directions. The way you need to go. You will pick the way you want to go. And if you somehow need to adjust it because there's more traffic the way. You can adjust it like that. Oh, well that didn't work. But. You can see it again. Oh, the, you get the point. If you need to, you can change it. And you can also send it to your phone. Or you can... If you need to adjust it. See, so yeah, I wouldn't go that way because it's right near the highway. But you can adjust it to go down here. Or you can adjust it differently based on what you wanted to. And that's basically how you do it. Alright, that's it for this quick tutorial. And I will see you next time.